Hello and welcome back to another video. Today we will be going over 15 fun facts about ancient Egypt. But before we start make sure to leave a like and subscribe, and turn on that notification bell so that you're notified when we next upload. And without further ado let's jump right into it. Number 1. Pyramid Alignment The Great Pyramids of Giza are not just architectural marvels, they are also astronomically aligned. The sides of the Great Pyramid are closely aligned with the cardinal points, north, south, east, and west. Moreover, the pyramid's layout corresponds with the stars in Orion's belt, which was associated with Osiris, the god of the afterlife. This alignment reflects the Egyptians' advanced knowledge of astronomy and their belief in a connection between the heavens and the pharaoh's journey to the afterlife. Number 2. King Tut's Tomb the discovery of King Tutankhamun's tomb by Howard Carter in 1922 was one of the greatest archaeological finds of all time. Unlike many other tombs, King Tut's tomb was largely intact, containing over 5,000 artifacts, including a solid gold coffin, chariots, and the famous Golden Death Mask. The tomb's discovery provided unprecedented insight into the wealth and artistry of the New Kingdom period. Number 3. Cleopatra was an Egyptian. Although Cleopatra VII is one of the most famous figures associated with Egypt, she was actually of Macedonian Greek descent. She belonged to the Ptolemaic dynasty, which was established by one of Alexander the Great's generals after Alexander's empire was divided. Despite her Greek heritage, Cleopatra embraced Egyptian culture, learned the Egyptian language, and portrayed herself as the reincarnation of the goddess Isis. Number 4. Cats were sacred. Cats held a special place in ancient Egyptian society and were associated with the goddess Batet, who was depicted as a lioness or a woman with a lioness head. Cats were revered for their ability to protect crops and homes from pests like mice and snakes. Killing a cat, even accidentally, was considered a grave offense punishable by death. Many families kept cats as pets, and some even mummified them to be buried with their owners. Number 5. Scribes had it good. Scribes were among the most respected members of Egyptian society because literacy was rare and highly valued. They were responsible for recording important information, including tax records, religious texts, and legal documents. Scribes were often exempt from physical labor and taxes, and their role provided them with social mobility and a comfortable lifestyle. The profession of scribe was often passed down from father to son, creating a class of educated elites. Number 6. Egyptians loved board games. Board games were a popular pastime in ancient Egypt, with Senet being the most well-known. Senet, which dates back to around 3100 BC, was played on a grid of 30 squares and involved a combination of strategy and luck. The game had religious connotations, symbolizing the soul's journey through the afterlife. Other games like men and hounds and jackals were also popular, reflecting the Egyptians' love for leisure and social interaction. Number 7. First Peace Treaty The first known peace treaty in history was signed between the Egyptians and the Hittites after the Battle of Kadesh around 1259 BC. The battle was one of the largest chariot battles ever fought and ended in a stalemate. Pharaoh Ramses II and Hittite King Hattasili III agreed to a peace treaty that called for mutual defense and cooperation. The treaty, inscribed on a silver tablet, marked a significant diplomatic achievement and is considered one of the earliest examples of international law. Number 8. Wigs and Makeup both men and women in ancient Egypt wore wigs and makeup, which served practical and aesthetic purposes. Wigs were made from human hair or plant fibers and provided protection from the sun while also serving as a fashion statement. Makeup, especially coal eyeliner, was used to protect the eyes from the sun's glare and to ward off infections. The Egyptians believed that makeup had magical properties, and they used green malachite and black galena to create distinctive eye makeup designs. Number 9. Pharaoh Pepi II's Longevity Pharaoh Pepi II, who ruled during the 6th dynasty, circa 2278 to 2184 BC, is believed to have had one of the longest reigns in history, ruling for over 90 years. Pepi II ascended the throne as a child and continued to rule into his old age. 
His long reign, however, may have contributed to the decline of the Old Kingdom, as centralized power weakened and local officials gained more autonomy, leading to internal strife and fragmentation. Number 10. Workers were paid in beer. Beer was a staple of the Egyptian diet and was often used as a form of payment for laborers, including those who built the pyramids. Workers were given rations of beer, bread, and other provisions as part of their wages. Beer was made from barley and was a thick, nutritious beverage that provided essential calories and hydration. This practice highlights the importance of beer in daily life and its role as a currency of sorts in the economy. Number 11. Nile Crocodiles The Nile River was home to large and dangerous crocodiles, which were both feared and revered by the Egyptians. The crocodile god Sobak was associated with the Nile and was believed to have control over the waters. To honor Sobak, some crocodiles were mummified and buried in special cemeteries. These mummies have been found in large numbers, particularly in the region of Kamambo, where a temple dedicated to Sobak was located. Number 12. Obelisks. Obelisks were tall, four-sided monuments that tapered to a pyramid ion at the top, often made from a single piece of stone. They were erected in pairs at the entrances of temples to honor the sun god R.A. Obelisks were symbols of power and were believed to connect the earth with the heavens. The ancient Egyptians transported these massive structures over long distances, and many were later taken to other parts of the world by Roman emperors, where they still stand today in cities like Rome, Paris, and London. Number 13. Hatshepsut's Disappearance Queen Hatshepsut was one of the few female pharaohs and ruled Egypt for over 20 years during the 18th dynasty. After her death, her stepson Thutmose III ordered the destruction of her images and monuments, possibly to erase her memory and legitimize his rule. This act of damnatio memoriae, condemnation of memory, led to Hatshepsut's achievements being forgotten for centuries until modern archaeology revealed her significant contributions including her extensive building projects and successful trade expeditions. Number 14. Scarab Beetles Scarab Beetles were sacred in ancient Egypt and were associated with the god Capri, who was believed to roll the sun across the sky each day, just as the beetle rolls dung. Scarabs were commonly used as amulets for protection and rebirth. They were often inscribed with spells or names and placed in tombs or worn as jewelry. The scarab symbolism of renewal and transformation made it a powerful and enduring symbol in Egyptian culture. Number 15. Ancient Toothpaste The Egyptians were among the first to develop toothpaste, using a mixture of ingredients like powdered ashes, eggshells, pumice, and myrrh. This early form of toothpaste was used to clean teeth and freshen breath, reflecting the Egyptians' concern with hygiene and oral health. They also used twigs from certain plants as toothbrushes, and dental care was an important aspect of daily life, especially among the wealthy. And that's it for today. Make sure you leave a like and subscribe and turn on that notification bell so that you're notified when we next upload. See you next time.